Fellow real estate agents, I just got a new listing. I'm very excited about it. So in this video, I'm going to show you how I am using AI to remove all the furnitures that are just doesn't fit the style of the home and also how I'm using AI to virtually stage all of the empty rooms for the house. So you can use, you can follow along in this video step by step to get how to use one free tool and how to use one pay tool to virtually stage your home. So you're not paying tens of dollars, hundreds of dollars just to get access to programs that's basically using the same AI software that's virtually staging your home. So now let's get to the video. All right, I'm gonna show you exactly what I'm doing step by step so I can stage my newest listing, right? So I played around a little bit already and the tool, the, there are two tools that I'm gonna use. One is for free, uh, it's called Google Gemini, which is a platform that I demonstrated before. Uh, I'll show you how what to do there. Another one is called Leonardo.ai. I like Leonardo a little bit, it's basically because you can use different models out there, but at the same time, it removes all the watermark, gives me a more option like generating four image at the same time, multiple images at the same time, et cetera, right? They have a free plan. You can use the link down below to join it. But um, uh, you can. But before we get to that, I'm gonna tell you a little bit about my real estate AI society. Uh, in it, I'm gonna show you in this for this video. We're gonna have an AI staging prompting guy. He has all the different staging styles: the modern Scandinavian, Scand Scandinavian industrial mid-century luxury farmhouse coastal etc all of these styles and the problem that you use to remove all the furnitures um, in this little free guy you can access it in my real estate ai society once you join it for free you come to community and you click here youtube resource and then i'll post the link right here um, with the with the title and then you can access it there okay so the first thing we're going to do i'm going to show you there are a couple images that I have for my client. One of the issues is that she has these furnitures in her living room and they do not fit the style. These are outdated. She's a little, she, she's a little bit older. So this style does not attract anyone um, in photos, but with the photos taken right here. So the first thing or one thing I'm going to do is that we'll either remove these furnitures. If you don't know how it's a difficult process in like Photoshop, but you can just do it for, uh, very, very easily right here. So you're going to come to Leonardo.ai. I'm going to show right here. And then you click, this is the platform and then you click image and then you're going to click model right here. You're going to select nano banana as the model. Okay. And then the the prompt that we're going to use uh, is going to be right here, removing furniture. I'm going to copy this furniture and then we're going to copy and paste it over here. And then the next step is that once you, once you first got started, you will have no image right here. You're going to click this little photo right here and then click image reference. Now you're going to upload that image and this is the image that I uploaded before. And then you're going to say remove image. So this is very simple. I'm going to pause right here. All right. So you can see how amazing this is. The furnitures are all removed. He also preserved the perspective and the natural lighting, right? So that is also included, by the way, also included in the prompt that I've asked it to include, uh, to make sure you preserve the lighting and the shadows and, and the perspective of the room, because sometimes you might change the photo and you do not want that. Okay. So, uh, you can, you can, uh, get access to this prompt in my free AI society, uh, using link down below, but uh, this is one way you can remove all the furnitures and, but the, you also want to decorate it, right? You can either download this image and then upload this empty image and then, uh, uh, and then just uh, use the new prompt right there. I'm going to use this one furnish. I don't like modern um, for this style of home. We might try to go for a little bit of a, you know what? Yeah. A, a, a modern furnishing will be fine. I'm going to copy this one right here and then come back here. I'm going to change the image to one of the empty living rooms that I had uh, somewhere around here. Oh, I did not upload a, an empty room. Okay, that's fine. So let's try this one then. Let's just download this one right now. And then we're going to upload it. Very simple. We're going to upload this image right here. Perfect. 
perfect. So now I'm going to change the prompt. Remember, we copy the prompt, furnish and stage in the modern style. And then we're going to come back here and then we're going to generate. And here we go. It took about 30 seconds to generate, but they look good. Obviously, this one still changed the perspective a little bit. That's why I like to generate multiple images at the same time. Sometimes I might generate four of them because just in case uh, one of them changes the layout of the room. But still, you can see it looks fantastic, right? It looks fantastic. So that's a one way to generate it. I'm going to upload an empty room. I'm going to use image reference and let's say this is the bedroom. And for this bedroom right here, I want to use more of a, uh, doesn't want an industrial, coastal. Let's try the coastal. I don't know what coastal looks like. Let's do it right here. And then we're going to generate two images. Alrighty. All right. Here's what they look like. One is that it's still de decorated as if it's like a living room. So that's one way to improve the prompt, right? This is this way. Did this one direct decorated as a bedroom because this is a must master bedroom. This state. So I'm going to state right here, furnish and stage this bedroom in a coastal style. And look at that. They look fantastic. I like how it adds the curtains to make basically give more imagination what this home could look like. I like this one keeps the perspective, keeps the natural light, keeps the decoration looks really good. So this is probably the one that I'm going to use for my listing. And you can basically do this for all of the images that are empty rooms. First you remove the furnishing and then you just now use AI to virtual stage them. And it's very, very cheap, 80 tokens. Uh, I think for ten dollars you get like ten thousand tokens or something like that, or something high, eight thousand tokens. So it's basically a few cents to generate a couple images. But if you don't want to pay at all, you can also do it for free using this tool right here. Because Nano Banana is a Google model, right? So you can come here called Gemini.google.com, and then come here and then you select tools, create images, and you're gonna upload the image. I'm gonna do the same thing, use the same prompt first one is this one where you can see this one is the uh, furnished this one is uh, the furnished um, living room that with just just bad furnitures you're gonna describe the furniture as right here remove everything but keep the perspective so it's gonna do the same thing for you and now voila just uh, a few seconds later, this thing's generated. It looks fantastic. It's because it, it's exactly the same, right? It's exactly the same model that did the work right here. But the only thing you can notice right here is that you have a little watermark down here. You can also remove this watermark. It's pretty simple. I've done it in another video tutorial. If you want to know how, just join a community, ask the question, and I'll send you a Zoom link or like a Loom link, a video recorded link to show you exactly what to do. Such a simple task uh, to remove this little watermark right there. But you can do this for free using Gemini.google.com. And you can also change it to say now, because this is a conversation, so the next one is you're just going to decorate it without actually uploading it again. Let's see if this works. Perfect. So this took memory of the previous photo and then just change and added these furnishing looks great right all right so remember if you want access to this guy you can access it for free in my real estate ai society uh, you can join my real estate ai society for free and if you want to see how that ai avatar actually look like how that works i created a video showcasing that capability you in this video right here you can click it right there and take a look